Okay, this is the downstream side of the bridge <clears throat> looking down Pennypack Creek. Coming around to the bridge. I'm on the south side of the creek. Looking at the far north uh, arch. And you'll see the seam and the concrete and the, the sidewalk overhang. That seam right there. Water is getting into the bridge just above that arch. Not good. The upstream side is much worse. <clears throat> Here we are looking through the uh, south arch to the upstream side. You'll see the concrete there about halfway through. This is where the bridge was widened in 1893 on the downstream side, on this side. We have pictures of that 1893 widening. This concrete work was not done then, I don't think. It was probably done either in the 50s, about the same time that the, uh, the sidewalk, steel sidewalk was put in. And you can see that this steel sidewalk is uh, in really bad shape. The, uh, you can see the concrete coming through the steel. And there's a lot of evidence of, of that up on the surface, on the street level. That whole concrete is just, the, the steel is just rusted out all the way. This overhang on this side is not, there is no overhang on the other side, on the upstream side. So here we're walking through. And the concrete here. <clears throat> The bridge was widened in 1893, about twice as wide as it had been up to that time. So we are now, where this concrete is, we're under the original 1697 arches, the southbound arch. Now we're coming to upstream. And this is where the, you'll see that the overhang, well, there is somewhat of an overhang there for the sidewalk, not as much as on the other side, on the downstream side, but uh, it's about two feet. It's in pretty good shape, except for this seam right here. That is allowing a lot of water to get through and drip down. And this has been going on for years. I saw this 15 years ago. This is causing a major, major damage to the bridge here. It isn't in structural, uh, structurally unsound, but it's going to be if these bridge, if these stones start falling out of here and you can see that one already has and as those stones fall out uh, obviously the the bridge is the uh, you know it's in danger of well we don't want that to happen water's getting in there how far into the bridge uh, we don't know but it gets in there freezes and uh, and, and separates the stones uh, these three steel uh, iron pieces here they were put in probably at the widening in 1893 
uh, they aren't seen on the uh, other side. So they were put in to, sh to shore up the, uh, the half, the, the original uh, half width of the bridge now. Well, well, what was the original bridge? There's another spot over here that is getting water damage. See the stone coming out of there. There are there are other seams on on this uh, on the sidewalk, but none as bad as this as this one here. There's just like all sorts of water through. You can see water is getting down. Well, this is just a drain here. A little hole in the uh, right there. I assume that's supposed to be there, there, but maybe not. You can see the water is coming through, and again, getting into the mortar and over a little bit further. The same thing is happening. And then up here, we've got more damage to those stones. I guess you, uh, it would have to, it's, it's water damage, getting in, freezing. We have pretty good, uh, pretty bad deterioration right here on this bridge abutment. But uh, again, that's, that's from water uh, getting in into the stone, freezing. Here we're looking down Frankfurt Avenue, heading south. <laughs> 